Hey everyone, and welcome to my little unboxing of something new I have. I just bought this like a few days ago and it just came in courtesy of Amazon Prime. Now, I'm only doing this with one hand, so bear with me. It's kind of a little bit difficult. Also, I will not be live streaming today because i kind of busy, but I will try to live stream tomorrow. But I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing. Yep, it's another PlayStation 5 Do Sasha Sense controller. Let me pull out my other one. Here's my other one, and as you can clearly see, it has a different skin or cover right here. And, huh, weird. That's weird. It should have that. They seem to have forgot to give me. I also purchased something like this for this one, but it's not in the box. What happened? Like they just gave it to me in this. So maybe that piece will come later to the day. Well, in the meanwhile, let's just continue unboxing this. Let's see, this is a little difficult to open it with just one hand. So let's just, uh, I had to uh, use my other hand to get it. So it comes with a box within a box. Boxception, wait a minute. So box, box, box. Three boxes. One bet there's a fourth box inside here. <laughs> nope. It's just the controller. And here are the two controllers side by side. And you can see how the, just putting a little cover like that greatly changes the color of the controller. Wait. Do they not give me a charging cable? Are you kidding me? Almost eighty bucks, and they didn't even include a charging cable. Well, that's that's just lazy. I guess they had to cut cards somewhere, and apparently, oh, we'll just leave the wire out. I'm sure the people have the why already okay granted yes a lot of people will probably already have a type C to USB connector so I guess they're not wrong on that part but um, well there you go there's my unboxing of the PlayStation DualSense controller with the default cover or whatever you call it and you can clearly see it definitely adding difference it basically changes the controller dramatically sorry about my hand in the shot well i hope you enjoyed this little unboxing if you did drop it a like share this video with your friends and until saturday i'll see you in my live stream again at 3 p.m. Until then, see you later. Hey guys, I'm back. Update video. I just checked the post earlier and here it is. If it wasn't stuck to this thing. And this is the uh, pooling tool. Which you use to like literally pop the old one off and stick the new one on. And when you do that, It ends up looking like that so yeah so you can imagine what that baby's gonna look like when I pop that off now granted you're gonna need two hands so I can't very well show you on screen but uh, yeah that should give you an overall idea of what it will look like it also comes with these extra washers 
they came with that one too so and just for the record this is not from Sony it's from a third party so yeah so so I guess I'll just use a little magic try light would you mind doing the honors thank you try light and there you go there you can see it's all beautiful and golden now and you can clearly see and also I didn't need these extra washers but it's always good to have them in case something should happen and the washers around here end up like breaking on me and if you have noticed I got a little Sonic there I also have Tails and Knuckles. These three things are actually cell phone holders, but they can also double as controller holders. As controller holders and ironically just like as the games came out first I got Sonic like in Sonic the Hedgehog 1 and then Tails who was appeared in Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and then Knuckles which came out around Sonic the Hedgehog 3 so I basically got these in the order where they were announced or premiered I love these two guys now my only regret is this, this is all they got they only got classic Sonic Tails and Knuckles they don't have classic Amy or Shadow or any other characters because there were no classic versions of them so but other than that I love them and I guess you could say my Sonic collection is starting to grow because honestly the very first Sonic toy if you can call it was the Amiibo this thing yes this was literally my very first Sonic toy or statue I guess we should call it yeah and I figured hey I'm a Sonic fan I buy all the Sonic games so I should show a little bit more love for Sonic so I got started with the Sonic statue then I liked it so much I wanted the Tails one and I wanted to finish the set so I got the Knuckles so I have the complete set I guess you could say this is a little bonus video, so... Sans, stop peeking out over the edge. We'll just call that Sans for now, okay? Anyway, I just wanted to add this little video at the end, so, uh... Yeah, stay tuned for Saturday for my live stream. Till then, later!